Hello souls, how are you? My voice is almost back to normal, so it's time for another miraculous reading. Today we're going to make another raw reading, and the topic I choose is Who was Princess Catherine being targeted by Thomas Crooks? If you don't know who Thomas Crooks is, this is the man who tried to assassinate President Trump. And apparently he was having materials related to Princess Catherine on his computer, along with materials related to Joe Biden and Donald Trump. So we are going to check what was his uh, plan regarding Princess Catherine. Was he trying to follow her in some way? What was her intentions? What was his intentions towards her? And uh, we are going to check if there's an active threat to her life. Because we know that as soon as somebody has some malicious idea, somebody else tries to copy, copy them. And this is concerning. So if you're curious, stay till the end of this reading. And please don't forget to like and subscribe. I remind you that all the information in this video is alleged. So let's start with the first question. Why he decided to download materials related to Princess Catherine? Why he targeted her from all the options? He had she lives in another continent. So what was his plan? Ten of Pentacles. And the plan was uh, most of uh, hitting to the royal family as she's part of it and uh, he knew he was unable to travel he didn't expect to travel and go to the uk but uh, somehow he waited for the right moment he was expecting somehow destiny to bring her in america perhaps and to allow him to see her and to give him some opportunity. So he was waiting for destiny to give him this opportunity. He was expecting this moment, but eventually he died. Why he chose her instead of another? person more reachable queen of swords ten of swords judgment eight of pentacles and eight of cups He, he read something, something written about her and it was having some negative uh, tone, perhaps an article or something like this. And he, he chose her based on this, something very negative towards her. It could be also something from the period where when everybody was speculating why she's not um, showing herself. And he, this was the moment when he decided that she's a person of interest for him. Then he tried to make a plan, but, but eventually he 
walked away from it. Why he decided to get rid of somebody at all? What was his motive? Why it was so important for him to do this to another human being? Nine of Cups, personal satisfaction. Oh, he was just psych psycho. He didn't have any logical motive. And uh, with the Knight of Swords, we have somebody who also is uh, a little bit dramatic, uh, somebody who doesn't have real knowledge about life, but uh, who likes to lecture other people about what's right or what's wrong and uh, so on. So he was absolutely convinced that uh, he was doing the right thing, but the bottom line is uh, his personal satisfaction. He has this uh, grandiose self-esteem. And at the same time, he was feeling uh, a little bit depressed. Yes, Four of Cups. Once again, he had regrets um, for not being uh, popular, personal insecurities as well. And the chariot, and he wanted to, he wanted to be a part of the army. Uh, if I remember correctly, this card appeared also in my reading about the shooting against Donald Trump. He wanted to be part of the army, military men, have power, but he was unable to control his wills. Let's take another deck. Is there any threat for the life of Princess Catherine right now? She does not show that often anymore in public, but is there any threat by another person? that should be considered. Nine of Cups once again. Page of Pentacles. Nine of Wands. I would say that uh, there is a person who who wishes her not very well, who wants to see her suffer. This is a very young person. And uh, it's even younger than Thomas Crooks. So should be a teenager. And this person is also waiting for the right moment to take action. She, uh, this person knows that she's protected, but this person lives. I think this is a young boy, teenager, perhaps, who, who is waiting for the right moment and believes that destiny will give them this opportunity. It reminds me about Tom's crooks and what was going on in his head. So somebody else picked that idea and it's younger person. Will there be something going on in the future? Should this person be considered as a threat?
Two of Pentacles. So this is a so so answer. For the moment, they are considering the options and uh, things are not uh, yet uh, did not finish to form. Four of Wands and Strength. This person is uh, too young for the moment and they need to grow. For the moment, they are not being a threat as they are too young. And uh, what about in the future? Yes, within the, at least a year, but I would say even a longer period, period they could become a threat. They just want to get rid of the monarchy and even to get rid of King Charles, like a head of the church. And they believe that uh, this should stop, the monarchy should end. <clears throat> what is the time frame of their action when this could occur? The world. Page of Cups. The work the word card shows longer period of time and uh, they could resemble this man you see here. But once again mm, we have this message that they are still young. So, William should become a king. Will their attempt going to be stopped or is going to be successful? What is going to happen? <clears throat> it's going to be prevented as we have the Seven of Wands. And uh, this usually speaks about situation where somebody is being attacked, but they are on a privileged position and they can deal with the situation and be the winner from it. And uh, by the way, this card appears appeared also with the assassination attempt of Donald Trump. He was in a better position, regardless of everything. So the royal family is going to be safe. Nobody is going to have a successful attempt um, of assassination, assassination or any kind of attack against them. So that was today's reading, my dear souls. Thank you very much for watching it till the very end. If you liked it, give me a thumbs up, share and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.